Hi there! For today's video, we will be learning about subtraction of similar fractions. What are similar fractions? Similar fractions are fractions which have the same denominators. Since they have the same denominators, they are also known as like fractions or common fractions. Examples are 4 eighths and 5 eighths, 7 twelfths and 9 twelfths. How to subtract similar fractions? 8 fifteenths minus 4 fifteenths. First, subtract the numerators. 8 minus 4 is 4. Next, copy the common denominator. The common denominator for 8 fifteenths and 4 fifteenths is 15. So, 8 fifteenths minus 4 fifteenths is 4 fifteenths. Then simplify or write the answer in lowest term. Since 4 fifteenths is in its lowest term, 4 fifteenths is our final answer. For exercise 1, you are given 60 seconds to answer numbers 1, 2, 5. Here are the correct answers for exercise 1. For our second example, subtract 10 25ths from 15 25ths. First, Subtract the numerators. 15 minus 10 is 5. Next, copy the common denominator. So the common denominator for 15 25ths and 10 25ths is 25. Then, simplify or write the answer in lowest term if necessary. 15 25ths minus 10 25ths is 5 25ths. To simplify 5 25ths to its lowest term, we will divide our numerator and denominator by 5. 5 divided by 5 is 1. 25 divided by 5 is 5. So 5 25ths when reduced to its lowest term, is one-fifth. For exercise two, you're also given 60 seconds to answer numbers one, two, five. Here are the correct answers for exercise 2.
for our third example, subtract 15 fourteenths from 30 fourteenths. First, subtract the numerators. 30 minus 15 is 15. Next, copy the common denominator, which is 14. Then, simplify or write the answer in lowest term. 30 fourteenths minus 15 fourteenths is 15 fourteenths. To simplify 15 fourteenths, divide 15 by 14 and the answer is 1 and 1 fourteenth. 1 and 1 fourteenth is our final answer. For exercise 3, you are given 2 minutes to answer numbers 1 to 5. The correct answers for exercise 3. For our quiz, find the difference of the following fractions, then simplify your answer. Here are the correct answers for our quiz. Hope you have learned something from our discussion today about subtraction of similar fractions. Always remember, math is easy, math is fun, love math, and math will love you. Thanks for watching. If you gain something from this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. And don't forget to smash the notification bell for our incoming videos. Bye! See you in our next video.